okay guys uh, now i'm going to show you about uh, this uh, app called uh, open camera uh, now i'll show you about this this is the app this is an open source uh, camera software for android and uh, here's the camera uh, this is the web page for it and uh, this is the web page for it in uh, google play uh, this is basically uh, a open uh, camera mark Harman photography and uh, it's a free software without any in-app purchases or ads or anything like that um, it's a nice one now I'll uh, show you the settings the main part of it now here goes now, this is the setting and uh, it has got uh, loads of settings uh, lock photo video orientation face detection camera controls timer uh, timer is like this from no timer to five minutes then uh, burst mode uh, off to unlimited then uh, burst mode intervals uh, no delay to two hours then uh, we have more camera controls um, touch to capture pause after taking photograph shutter sound timer beep we've got a timer beep voice timer countdown volume keys volume keys uh, there are so many options uh, to set volume keys for focus zoom in and out and all that uh, do nothing as well then uh, save location you can save it in a place where we want in the phone then uh, we can use uh, storage access framework that is opening from then uh, we can uh, save we can save a prefix for the photo img is what uh, i've done here then uh, we can do a similarly as uh, the photo we can do for the video as well now uh, show camera when locked the screen is locked it shows then lock screen while recording video then rotate preview then uh, let's go to uh, more camera controls uh, no uh, this is what we saw now uh, we'll go to on, sc on screen gui we've got a lot of things that will show up on the screen when we do this uh, immersive mode then um, uh, preview size, uh, UI replacement, uh, then uh, show zoom, uh, we have got uh, zoom controls, uh, show free memory, how much of uh, space is available in the camera, show angle and uh, angle highlight color, show compass direction, show time, show battery, show a grid and the grid has got several options like so, uh, so many types of grids. Uh, then we have show a crop guide, show a toast message and show thumbnail, thumbnail, thumbnail animation. Then uh, we have uh, photo settings. Uh, the most important thing here is the camera resolution. It starts from the lowest to the highest and of course it depends on the uh, hardware you have. The image quality, it says 90 is the best, it goes up to 100. Then uh, stamp photos, this I am using it. I stamp the photos with the time and date uh, wherein we can have a date format. Then uh, we can have the timestamp format. Then we can have GPS format as well. All these can be done, stamped on the photo. Then we can have a custom text as well. That is, we can have a text like watermark, something like that. Then uh, we have font size for that, font color for that, and text style. Then similarly, we have video settings for which we have video resolutions. We can change the resolution. That, that of course, depends on the uh, hardware we have, that phone we have. Then bit rate, frame rate. Duration of the video, it will stop recording automatically after a specified duration, unlimited to one hour. Then we have uh, restart after maximum. Record audio, which I am doing now for this. Audio source, several sources, camcorder and optimized for voice. Then uh, we have flash uh, while recording, audio channels, stereo and mono. Uh, then uh, we can have, we have location settings wherein we can uh, store location data that is geotagging you must have seen this when uh, looking for specs in the phones then uh, here is uh, another option called uh, store compass direction gps compass direction also stored in the photo then there's an option where we can take a photo only when the location data is enabled which of course i have not checked here so this is about this open camera uh, this is a nice app uh, and it's available in uh, uh, play and I'll show you some of the photographs which I've taken with this app. Uh, this one, you can see this one. Then, uh, then 
these are the photographs I've taken with this open camera and uh, you can see you can see the stamp there uh, in the watermark and this one and this one it's, it's a butterfly difficult to take photographs then uh, this one too and this is a swinjit mark yeah that's about it open camera